Hi everybody, my name is Jim with Full Moon Adventure Club and today we're going to be showing you how to connect two batteries in series. So if you had two 12 volt batteries and you connected them in series, you would end up with 24 volts. This also applies to six volt batteries. So if you just imagine these are two six volt batteries and you do the exact same thing, you're going to go from six volts to 12 volts and that would be a double six battery setup. Today we're going to be using 12 volt batteries, but the, the principle is exactly the same. So we're going to be doubling the voltage of these and uh, we're going to turn two 12 volt batteries into one 24 volt battery. So why don't we jump in there? This is incredibly simple. Anybody can do it. And I'm going to show you exactly how right now. Okay, so we do have two 12 volt lithium iron phosphate batteries here. And I'm going to just check the battery levels. Both of those are fully charged. Love these batteries just because those gauges are so nice on there. So you can check and see just how much power they have without even having to uh, use a tester. Now I'm going to put this little voltmeter up here so you guys can kind of check out the voltage and that'll give you a good idea of what's going on and what the end result is. Now what we're going to end up doing is these are really nicely marked. You can see the positive and the negative on each terminal and uh, this is going to be really great. So as I test with the voltage here, it's, you're going to have 13.5 volts because these are lithium batteries and they're fully charged. You might have 12.6, but this is the same, same exact situation on both batteries, 13.5 volts. So that's great. Now, all we're going to do is I'm going to move this little voltage meter out of the way here for us. And we're going to take whatever gauge wire that you're using for your application. In my gauge, in my case is a two gauge wire, uh, similar to what you'd see hooked up to your batteries in a car. Um, and so what we're going to do in order to double the voltage across these two batteries is I'm going to take a wire and connect it to the positive of that back battery. And then I'm going to connect the other side of it to the negative of the other battery, the bottom battery. And once we have this done, uh, that's your series connection. That's all there is to it. Now, when you connect your RV, you're going to use the unconnected terminals here, battery one and battery two. So I'm going to put my voltage meter back up here and show you exactly what I'm talking about here. Let me just get this situated a little bit. Okay. Now, as we check the voltage across the battery bank, um, what we're going to have is double the voltage. So I'm going to take my test leads here, connect to the negative of battery one and the positive of battery two. And you can see, uh, we, I actually have to up my voltage meter to a higher voltage there. When I connect across here, you're going to see we have 27 volts and 13.5 volts and 13.5 volts equals 27 volts. So that's the way you want to connect your RV. You can see that each battery is still putting out 12 volts. If you go just connected to one battery, there's 13.5 and 13.4. And uh, the real magic happens when you bridge the connection, you go from battery one to battery two, and then you can see we have double the voltage. And that's how you would connect your RV if you wanted to double the voltages by going across battery one and two to the positive and negative. I hope that was easy enough for you. Hope that demonstrates exactly how to double the voltage of any battery, and this would work with six volt batteries as well. Okay, so very, very easy, and I hope you guys can imagine doing that with six volt batteries. It's exactly the same and uh, you're gonna end up by doubling the voltage of whatever batteries you have. So two sixes is gonna become one big 12 volt battery and two 12 volt batteries is gonna become one big 24 volt battery. And of course I was using lithium batteries so the voltage was 13.5 and 13.5. So when we added them together, it was 27. But the same thing applies and it's very easy. Anybody can do it and I hope that helped you out. If it did, please like, share, subscribe. That really helps me out. And until the next video, thank you so much for watching and happy camping.